Um, for those of you who are following me on Instagram, you all know that I recently purchased a Rick Owens Fogashine Spartan thigh high kiss boots from Ukes several days ago for 202 US dollars. I kid you not, I think that's the best bargain that I'll ever get from Rick Owens ever. So anyway, um, we rescheduled the delivery today, so I'm waiting for him. Amazing service from DHL. And I will update you in a short while. We will be celebrating and I'll have a surprise for you. Today we're going out for our 10th year anniversary. I mean, who could have believed we will reach this far? We are going to this really cool place. I'm wearing my Rick Owens jacket. Yeah. Just to be a bit extra. It's starting to get chilly, so I'm really excited. This is my birthday outfit. Very simple. So my OG Rick Owens cross boots. Boom. My trusty Chester coat from Rick Owens. Jack Moo. Jack Moose. And the necklace from Dark Libido. Follow Dark Libido on Instagram at Dark Libido. And yeah. Another Rick Owens. Everything Rick Owens. So I'm 36 today. Super old. As I get older, I commemorate my day by wearing outfits that push boundaries, meet the mini shroud jacket from Rick Owens, an explosive gargantuan silhouette, a confluence of rock star and crip glamour, a dystopian red carpet for my birthday. Hello Anikawa, my favorite restaurant. We're back. Huh? Talk. Um, super hungry. It's my 36th birthday. This restaurant is super, super special. Very close to my heart because it's very intimate. That's what I like. And the interior, you'll have to see it. The food is artisanal and the, the, the chef is... Artisanal too. <laughs> Artisanal Japanese. My outfit today, super hard to wear, super hard to move. I hope I can fit in because it's a small space and I hope I don't break glasses. The last time I've worn this jacket, I've broken champagne glass.
Three minutes of octopus then used to chimney spice on the side, giving it fresh dash. You dip it into the soft and then you dip it onto the spice. That's too soft now. Foggy. Oh, I failed. Oh my god, what a fail. Thank you. Put the fish in dashi and then yeah. you wrap them on the knife. Type of rice, yellow pie, kamasu, urban belly mushrooms, and some fresh type. Gelatin. It's water. It's water. It's art insulation and you know me I love insulation art and uh, yeah it's very alien like and grotesque and abstract in a way it's beautiful you have to come see 
He's my favorite right here. It's like to get an alien's intestine or an appendage. It's leather. It's leather. Don't touch it. <laughs> I think it's made from really soft lambskin leather. It's very grotesque. This is my outfit for today. We are in Brisbane and we're gonna do perfume shopping. It's a Saturday and I just thought of doing something casual. For the most part, it's warm and sunny. Rick Owens by Curve Vest with my Phlegathon mermaid skirt, my Turbo Wedge. Nothing too grand about this outfit, but I like it, it's comfortable for the comfortable day. Rand is wearing Andy Willemister as well. He's a very cool pirate for the day. He mixed navy with black and I love that he's wearing like this cloth satchel from Andy Willemister. I love the boots from Rick Owens. And he's so excited because we're gonna do fragrance shopping. After 300 perfumes that we tried, I finally picked four samples. It's better to try out expensive perfumes than committing to a full-sized one. And me as a Gemini, it's hard for me to pick my favorites. So I have some samples here and they even gave me like freebies. So I have the Dolce Amalfi. I've also got the Oud Dolce. Everything that I've picked up are gourmet based and kind of oud and leathery. Because I snagged a bargain. I mean, it's only nine o'clock, but who cares? And it's a Friday. I feel like drinking. And I hate it when people in YouTube open their vlogs with coffee and stuff. Like, isn't it so boring? Still waiting for the DHL guy. Hey, baby. I'm here, baby. This is the first one. I haven't told the Ren that I bought two. He will know later. But it's a good bargain, right? I was 
supposed to pick it up at the service center, but according to the kind driver, because of the size, it's too massive, they can only deliver. But see, I'm always working. And yeah, that's just how complicated deliveries are. I really hate it. One of the neighbors asked what's inside and I was like, oh, it's just a furniture. So this is the tall box. And inside, oh my gosh. This is the yellow, the, um, what do you call that? The sulfate or ochre fog machine Spartan kiss boots. Baby, baby, baby girl, look at the price. It's 202 US dollars. Cheaper than a pair of boots from Zara. So it's real. I thought it's fake news. So it's a real transaction. Because I was doubting Yuke's. Like I thought it was like a mistake. Um, I'll tell you the story later on. But yeah, amazing. So let's open the black one, okay? And it didn't come with a dust bag. But who cares? I have like 700 dust bags already. I'll be back. The other one has dust bag. And this is the black version. Amazing. Wait, what? Okay. I thought it was shorter, but it's the same. This is in a size 41, brand new. No one has tried it on yet. Although, it's not the best in terms of quality. Like, um, it's got some glue marks, but my gosh. Am I gonna complain for a $200 boot? But it's fine. Like, I probably just wear it two times in a year <laughs> knowing me but yeah amazing I'd love to show you and do a dance for you and show you how it fits how it looks like but um, I have an appointment today and uh, I have a full plate so I'll be back for a review on my next video perhaps So now it has like this boning panels that Lauren did. Whoa. But it creates a different effect. First, we're gonna try the Dementor skirt. Why Dementor it reminds me of the Dementors from the Harry Potter movie. Scary, fluid, and dark. The neutral lab one off maxi skirt that Lorenz did over the weekend. One size fits all because you got this um, loop closure. It's also made from coated denim. And this is the logo branding. First, you have to button. So it's got the two closure mechanism. You've got to button the inside with this button. And then the second closure would be this lobster clasp. Super awesome. Easy ass. Yeah, et voila. And it's a nice maxi long line skirt. If you want to show off the boots, like I said, you can do that by arranging the slits. And it also reminds me of Andy Blumister. It has the same spirit, it has the same mechanism. I like how it flows, I like how it moves with you. And this is the next one, it's called the Vector Jacket. So it has the bell-shaped sleeve. Well, technically, relatively, it's like a kimono, but it, it's made from this foamy organza fabric. Laurent used a coated denim as a 
a finishing for the lapel which I really love and I think it's one size fits all as well because it didn't have, didn't have any closure and yeah it's a massive silhouette extra oversized but crop so you can still wear this while playing with proportions we're on to the next one this is the prisoner skirt so this is how it looks like mid-length asymmetrical skirt with this lobster closure detail and the fabric is made of um this really nice panel cotton it's actually good with like thigh high boots it just has the right length and i like it when it covers the back of my legs do you have another styling bag and he's making it extra tight This is the convict top. Yeah, it's very simplistic, but it has a bit of an edge because it has this stoma kind of um, choker thingy. And in the back, that's the ma where the magic happens. And I like it when it's worn because look at that. Very simple, but it has this appeal. And also you can wear the front cape as a skirt. I love skirts because you can layer them with anything, you know, flex your boots. And this skirt is not your usual skirt, like this is asymmetrical. So please visit our website, neutrallab.com, and thank you for your support. We are going out tonight to see a launch of someone I knew from Instagram. She's based here in Brisbane. I just finished my makeup. This is the shoes that I'm gonna bring. I've always imagined myself wearing this to an event. This is like the Bolan, the Bolan shoes. Slay. Mega I feel like I need to wear something to make to look stronger. Perhaps a jacket. There's something lacking about this outfit.
We met some good people, fashionable people. I hope things like this happen a lot here in Brisbane. Everyone love your outfit, apparently. My outfit, this outer blazer is from Yoji. Yoji Yamoto, yes. And then, yeah, Marjola Ring. Accessorize it with an Mr. Mister necklace. And yes. this is my own DIY necklace. Neutral lab. And I have my Mr. shirt. And then you Mr. Bag. Oh my gosh. Goins, Man Wedge, yeah. I think I'm a bit drunk tonight, but yeah, I got these shoes from Isabella Charles. I didn't know she's going to Berlin, so um, I'm a bit sad, but I'm happy for her, for them. Um, this is the shoes, and I'm gonna wear this as a house shoe. <laughs> it's a beautiful leather clog boots. And yeah, my outfit is the Rick Owens anthem jacket, Rick Owens Lily's top dress, and my Stag 2008 Archive Rick Owens boots. I finally took the courage to wear this tonight. So it was a good night, right? Like, did you enjoy it?